now? You sweating yet, Dutch? Of course I'm sweating. We're in some disease-ridden, swampy, Dixie whistling shithole. We've been here for a while now. about these bounty I'm not sweating as such, but maybe a little gentle perspiration. A gentle perspiration. Too much harm and wasting good liquor on sweating. So, so, I think you should pay Mr. Trelawney a visit and find out exactly what he knows and who he spoke to. Take charge with you. Oh, the sight of the pair of you would make a statue sing out its secrets. Okay. Why don't you go ask Trelawney? My lady. Why didn't Trelawney just tell us to begin with? Hey, there might be bounty hunters after you, but I'm not going to bother saying anything about it. Charles, we got to go find that weirdo ourselves. I some business in town. Come on. Okay. Where are we going? Gotta go see Trelawney. He's been in this game like twice so far, but I guess. Yeah. Who isn't after us? The Pinkertons, Cornwalls. I mean, probably Leviticus Cornwall hired the bounty hunters to come get us. Like, what? What else would it be? Yeah. On the run from one bunch of lawmen, working for another. Ain't that the truth? Hiding in plain sight, Dutch calls it. Mm-hmm. Mm. Although, so, with all these people after us, I don't know how much longer we can hide. I mean, we got some space between us and that mess now. I ain't seen no more Pinkertons for a while. Don't There's jinx it, Arthur. Hunters, You're gonna jinx it. Dutch don't seem too worried about it. Can't believe they're still coming after us. We didn't even get away with the money. Dude, we've killed so many people and stolen so much money. We're like public enemy number one through 20, given how many people are in our band. In our band of misfits, a gang of odd folk. And now it seems that Trelawney might be in this shack. Oh, yep. There he is. Bounty hunters caught him. Yes. Okay. They're just gonna run away. Do they not have guns? What kind of bounty hunters don't carry guns? Unless they want to take us in alive. But we have a lot of guns, so maybe they should have armed themselves. Okay, okay. We gotta find him. Hide it in this corn. There's one. Okay, he's taken out. But, but there could be birds anywhere. What do you, it's they fly. They could be they could be in any place. Dude, where is this way? Oh my gosh. Am I gonna be here for like days looking for these guys? Come on, I've been searching for so long. There's a, what? Oh, Arthur. No. Top hat man. He's choking me, Charles. He does have a gun. Unless that's my gun. Ooh. Throwing knife. Idiot put his gun away. You should have taken the money. I know. I'm a fool. What did you get? Okay. I get. Oh, oh, oh. They're shooting the corn. Okay. Ow. They're shooting me. Can I just. Give me my gun. Let's fight back. There we go. It's either one shot to the head or three shots to the body. That's pretty much it. It seems to be the case with like every gun except a shotgun. Oh, oh, oh. oh. Cover. Got him. And bounty hunters dealt with. Give me your money. I've taken your bounties. I'm the bounty hunter hunter. Okay. Never fine. So, who was they? 
Who was they? Really? Bounty hunters. Who is Cole Stoudemire? Weren't looking for me, per se. What you tell him? Not much. I told them I was an intellectual. An intellectual, you say? from Oregon, looking for a job at the university. Hmm. They didn't believe me. Why? Seems you stirred up quite a hornet's nest in Blackwater. Yeah, well, whatever happened in Blackwater was apparently the worst crime in human history for the way they're coming after us. Charles, you take Trelawney back to camp. I'll catch up with you. Okay. Okay, Trelawney's hanging out with us. Cool, maybe? I don't know. Hopefully the bounty hunters don't follow him to our camp. More and more civilization. Yeah. I want to get back in the open country of the West. Or what's left of it. But and there's not much left. Even that ain't the way I remember it. No, it ain't, Arthur. No, it ain't. Micah. Here we go again. Let's Micah. Hey, that's... That's hey, the Mom, mission is called. Sale? Yeah, I don't care, Micah. I literally don't care sure at all. all that line of thought serves you and me very well. Uh, that's because we are not peacemakers. Are man of profoundly limited intelligence. No doubt. Well, you and the old man in Dutch have been running around... Digging us ever deeper into shit. No, what have Mr. you been doing, Micah? Might have gone and lighten the load a little. Pearson! Ain't you curious? What yes, did gentlemen. Pearson do besides Dutch. just stand around and you yell at Sadie? Man. It's peace, Dutch. The Adriscals. I mean, I think there's a way. What on earth are you talking about? Get the words out properly, fat man. I met a couple of the Adriscal boys on the road in the town. Things were about to get ugly. But you know how I am in a fight, huh? Like a corner tiger. <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm sure. I'm sure. Anyway, somehow it didn't, but we got to talking, and they suggested a parlay to end things. Like hmm. Gentle, gentle. Hmm. Old, old Sounds like a trap. Have you lost your mind. You're always telling us, Dutch, do what has to be done, but don't fight wars ain't worth fighting. They want a parley? It's a trap. Well, of course, it's... Probably a trap, but what do we got to lose finding out? Our lives? Shot. Yeah. <laughs> because you'll be protecting us. Okay, but I could get shot. Trap, you shoot the lot of them. If it ain't a trap, that slim chance. I don't see the point in any of this. You don't see it's the point in ending a war. Gotta take. I killed Combs' brother. A long time ago. Then he killed a woman I loved dear. Mm. As you say, it's a long time ago, Dutch. Hmm. What are we gonna do? Let's go. You I guess we're gonna go. Arthur protecting us, no one else. What about me? This ain't the time for tigers, my friend. Ooh, called him out. Mm-hmm. Like Up on that hill. On be the eyes soon yes, I'll be the eyes on you yeah. and Colm. But who's? what if people got eyes on me? Where's my sniper? There it is. You murdered the entire town of Strawberry by yourself, pretty much. I killed a few, but not important. Oh, save it. I don't buy that for one second. Dutch does, though. <laughs> exactly. Well, he is, yeah. That's probably even more likely. Of this great nation, men created equal. Liberty and justice for all. That might be nonsense too. What are you talking about right now? What are you even talking about? This is this has nothing to do with that at all. Can't you see that, friend? I don't know. 
You are out of your mind. Both of you. I really don't want to be riding with you guys. Let's aim to meet back at the fork in the road afterwards. We'll be there, partner. Go to the observation position. I figured, because the game is telling me to go to the yellow dot, as it always does. All right, horsey. You got to be the eyes on me. You got to let me know if there's danger afoot. Because this is a trap. There's no way this isn't some kind of trap. No way things won't go awry the kind of game this is. I mean, that's the kind of game every game is. If there's no kind of conflict, you don't have a video game to play. Alright. Get my sniper ready. Okay, get out of here, bird. Oh, well maybe I'll be using my binoculars and not the sniper. My sniper can also zoom in, you know. That's what the scope is for. And there they go. There's Colm old Driscoll. Now I've got my sniper. Hello, Dutch. Been a while. <clears throat> sure. So, uh, how's your gang doing? They still believing in you? Better work. Unfortunately. Sure work. Hm? How's that coming along? Just fine. No, not really fine. How's that score you stole off us? It's pretty Which good. Oh, oh. <laughs> hit him with oh, a, like hit him that. with a, a zinger. Like I said, is a charismatic leader. A lot of heat on us this time. Of us. Come on, Arthur. They offered me a price, Dutch, to bring you in. Why didn't you take it? Well, still might. I am sorry about your brother. Hmm. Yeah, well, I never Is liked he him much. <laughs> I liked Annabelle. Ooh. Y'all love the ladies, Dutch Ooh. men, right? You like that he likes ladies? Here, Gome. Is this thing over? No, Arthur. It was a trap. But it was a trap for Arthur. Maybe Micah set us up. Hmm. Hmm. Micah really wanted us to do this. And it seems like I'm the only one caught in harm's way. Come on, Arthur. Come on. Escape the old Driscolls. Let's get out of here. Let's go. Run. Run for the trees. No, don't shoot me. On the main character. Oh. I tripped. Stop. I can see through my bandolier. No. You let me out of here, you crazy old Driscolls. We were going for a parlay. And now I'm parlaying in this cellar. That ain't cool. That ain't par for the course of this game. Usually I'm the one doing the killing around here. Something like that. It's good to see you. Is it now? How long have you, has he been lying upside down? Nah, it's a person, not a gun. Why would you want that? Charisma. Dutch's famous charisma. Sounds like some kind of meal he makes, some kind of food. 
Special dish. You gonna shoot me? You just asked me to work for you. Crap between you two. We all got real problems now. Boy, I see it. They get him. They forget about me. No. That you go after Dutch, I'll just go after the next big fish. And you, sir, are a big fish. I can't think of any big fish off the top of my head. Shark doesn't really count. Okay, you could do that. But you have me locked in a cellar for some reason. Could have taken me in. Mm. It's a tr 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 trap. A double trap. Owie. Oh. Oh. Was I wearing these pajamas before you kidnapped me? Did you take my clothes off and then put me in these pajamas? That's the real important question right now. The second most important question is how do I get out of here? Third most important question is how long have I been in here? Has it been just like an hour? A couple hours? You can swing on your shackles to reach the metal file. Yes, I can. Okay, swing right, swing left. Swing right, swing left. Right, left. There you go. Oh, I thought I would have had to do it like three times, but nope. Oh, broken back. All right, what are we doing? Some magic. I'm gonna try and cauterize the wound. What are we doing here? We're we gonna get the bullet out. Ooh. Ooh. We're gonna get the bullet out, aren't we? There's a lot of blood coming out, too. Okay. Some gunpowder. Mm-hmm. Just kind of throw the gunpowder everywhere. And then, yeah, now we got to cauterize it. Ooh, come on. Press the next button. Owie. It's a good thing nobody heard that. Oh, never mind. They they did actually hear that. Oh wait, no, they're actually arguing with each other about Mexico. Stealth kill. Ugh. Gotcha. Run! Come on, let's get out of here. Let's go, horsey. I think this is horsey. I can't really tell. Everything is purple. Oh! Oh! Throwing knife! Oh! Ah, no! Run! I don't have any of my guns. I can't see anything. Okay, let's get out of here. I think we're in the clear. We're about to be. We have no health, no anything really. It is horsey. Okay, good. I knew it. You gotta do this, horsey. You gotta get me home. I have to ride all the way home. Oh, I passed out. This is like the f one of the few times in this game where I don't have to ride the entire way. It'll just take me there automatically. I'm assuming it's taking me there. Nobody mounted a rescue operation. Nobody tried to save me. Unless they were planning it. It just didn't go yet. Well, looks like we're about to be back in camp. Hey everyone, I'm still alive. Don't worry about me. I may be worried a little bit. I fell off my horse. Arthur. Mary Beth. Arthur. Arthur. Hey, Dutch. I told you it was just set up, Dutch. My boy. 
My dear boy, what? They got me. But I, I got away. Yeah. Yeah, you did. Yeah, were you were you planning on helping me? I need help. Now, of course you need everybody else to come come help me. I'm sorry, Arthur. It is a bit late for apologies. Swanson! Mr. Morgan. Mr. Morgan, you're safe now. Oh, let's get him to bed. It's nice to see the gang actually cares about Arthur. Arthur says he doesn't have a family, but this is the closest thing he's got to that. That's real pretty. Miss Grimshaw, will you sit with him a while? Of course. You'll be okay, Mr. Morgan. Can you tuck him in, give him his blankie, his teddy bear? Well, we made it. We survived the ambush. Dutch didn't seem to be in any trouble, so I don't know what happened there. Did he... Because he didn't... He must not have killed Colm, because Colm was there. So did they have, like, a peaceful resolution? I don't know. A few weeks later. I guess we'll find out pretty soon. I thought I'd be burying you, Mr. Morgan. Hey, Swanson. You're sober. Well, not quite yet, River. <laughs> Good. How you feeling? Oh, uh, about the same as you. I'm sorry to hear that. <laughs> At least I got all my stuff back. Take care of yourself. Thank you, you Reverend. You seem to be taking care of yourself since I last saved you from a train. The O'Driscolls are going to need saving soon, though. He got some hell to pay. <sighs> okay. Back with Micah. Every single time we do anything with Micah, it all goes wrong. Last time I was in a town like this with Micah, we killed everybody. So this is a little, a little scary. I don't like this. Why is the town empty? This seemed legit to you, Bill. Sure. The music also very creepy. Very ominous. Feels like a setup. Yeah, let's just see what they say. They said there was some big misunderstanding about them. This isn't good. We're about to have a big shootout. That's what I've been saying, Arthur. Oh my gosh, Sean! They shot him! Oh my god, turned into an old man. Wow, okay, Sean's dead. Um, this is what you get. This crazy town. They killed Sean. Bill, shut up. Is he dead? Did you not watch the cutscene? His face exploded. I think Micah's gotta be setting us up. There's no way he keeps leading us into this into these crazy situations where we're suddenly ambushed every time. Oh, I almost didn't see this guy here. Hold on. There we go. I'm not going anywhere. Maybe I should run off on you. Put a bullet in your head. Save us all the trouble. What was the point of this, Micah? What was the point of this? We're going to have to leave this town. You need to get hold on this town. It's going to hell. you Mike has got to be one of the most hateable characters in a video game. We don't know what you've been doing. Come out, Sheriff. It's over. Sheriff Gray. Well, no more using him. Gray. 
Really? I already killed Sean. I don't know if they're gonna kill another main character. Well, I don't know if he's a main character. Ooh, did I? Come on. I'll get all four of these guys. I don't need your help, Micah. Okay, well, you did help out a little bit. R.I.P. He was a good kid. Well, how the hell was I to know? Let me see. They set us up once before. Oh, hey, this was Marcus, Bill's plan? We destroyed their farm. Should I go on? Go easy on him, Morgan. Micah. He's out trying to find a lead. Same as you. Same as Hosea. All you do is complain when things don't work out. Except when it's your goddamn fault. You don't know what you're talking about. You're I'm gonna put you in the ground, boy. Oh, you act so high and mighty, but you're no better than the rest of us. I've ridden with you boys close on what? Six months now? And all you ever done was complain. You can mm -hmm. fight, but you can't think. That's what you, you say. Can't do either. <laughs> okay, cowpoke. Bill, take the boy's body. Bury him proper someplace quiet. Maka? Best you and I don't speak for a moment. <laughs> I'm with me. So frightened by you. Get out of my sight, pair of fools. That was a mess. No more hiding. The Greys know that we are not to be trusted, which means the Braithwaites are also going to catch wind of that. But well, maybe they already knew. Little brother to me. What fun we had riding together. Man. What a goddamn mess we are making a thing. Things are falling apart really fast. Calm down. Uh oh. What's going on here? We are doing all we can. A group meeting. Am I missing out on something? Arthur, have you seen that boy, Jack? Uh oh. Where's my goddamn son? Blood feuds, ancient Where's and modern. Son? They took him, didn't they? They took my son. Who took your son? We think the Braithwaite woman took him. What? Oh, Kieran saw a couple of fellows sound like Braithwaite boys. Kieran? Where's, Where's Kieran been? Anything, like this entire game. Where is my son, Dutch Vandalin? We will find him. We will bring him back. How did the Braithwaites know where we are? And how did they take her kid? How does that even happen? Abigail, you have my word. Just get me back, my son. You know what? It doesn't even matter. We're getting that kid back. Let's go. Dutch is actually going to do something. This is crazy. Bring in the whole gang. Ooh. Let's go get that kid back. It took us four hours to get on our horses. He messed with the wrong group of people. You don't mess with the children. What just happened? Did Lenny get hit by his horse? It's a good thing they know we're coming. Come on, let's get this done. Then they know exactly who to be afraid of. Like I said, I'm fine. Follow my lead. Both these redneck families think they can ruin mm. us. I don't think so. We got everyone here. We're storming Braithwaite Manor. Who steals a goddamn boy? I'm gonna let fly at those sons of bitches. Don, I need you to stay calm. This is cool. It's not cool what they did though. Get down here now! Time for some frontier justice. What the hell do you want? What do you think? You're gonna give us that kid back now, boy. Easy, John. We've come for the boy. You must have known we would. Shouldn't have messed with our business now, should you? Whatever complaint you have with us, alleged or otherwise, 
that is a young boy. Yeah. You don't kidnap a kid. That is not the way you do things. Hand him over. Get the hell off my oh, poor choice of words. Oh no, there's one more gang. Okay. You got a couple more gang members? I could take all these guys out on my own easily. But if you ain't gonna I, no. be civilized about this. <laughs> Let's get him, boys. You don't you don't mess with children. We took him fishing that one time. We got a personal stake in this matter. Let's go. Ow. Okay. Got him. Okay. That was a headshot. I guess I just... It was more of a hat shot. Oh. That was bad. I'm missing. Okay. Oh. Bulletproof railings. Getting on my nerves. Let's go. Try to get closer. All right, we're breaking in. Time for some close quarters. Gonna need this shotgun ready. Hmm. Jack, you in here, boy? You you wanna go fishing, boy? John stepping up, actually being a father for once. Why would they take Jack? Yeah, let's kidnap a, a child and hope the gang doesn't come after us. Oh! Get out of my sight. Ooh, that was brutal. I'm coming. Just let me loot this guy. There you go. This is a really strong door. Ooh. Next shot and I shot. Oh, oh, these camera angles. Look at that. There we go. Oh no. Oh no. Yeah, don't kidnap a kid from a giant gang of outlaws, okay? You can die in this house too, boy. We, yeah. Kill the rest of them unless you start talking. Oh, I know your time. Common scum. Well, where is the boy? You filth. All right. We get her out of here. What about them? Ooh, that's what you get. Oh no, you killed my sons. You kidnapped a child. Okay, he's a son too. You don't get to cry about all this. Am I supposed to feel bad here? Because I don't. Yeah. Oh. Well, that was Hosea for a second. Oh, <laughs> uh, yeah. Oh, oh, sorry, Dutch. <laughs> yeah, burn this place down. Have any of their problems anymore. Killed all the greys in the town. I <laughs> killed all the Braithwaites at their big plantation. So much for this blood feud. We've killed basically all of them. Except Bo and Penelope. They're fine, I think. I never liked you. Why'd you take the boy, Mrs. Braithwaite? You stole my Boys are off limits. You stole we stole your liquor and horses, so you kidnap a child. Yes, yes, that's it. Where's the boy? You better start talking. Who is Angelo Bronte? I don't know where Saint Denis is. Uh oh. She's rich. Or he's rich. 
Her, she was rich, but her her place is burned down now. Is she running back in there? Whatever. Let her burn. We got a boy to go rescue. It looks like we're going to Saint Denis. So, I'm assuming we're going to start packing up and moving. The Battle of Shady Bell. Isn't that the place Lenny and I cleared out? Everybody's dead. Whatever battle was there already happened. If I don't get that boy back safe, um, she, she'll kill us all. I know. But we'll get him, John. Looking at this, logically, well, that boy is fine. They took him to scare us. Nobody takes a boy to harm. It's true. Why would they just kill think, a child? The boy will be fine. But well, of course, Marston scared rotten. We, we killed all those people. We stirred up all that trouble <laughs> for nothing. No, no. Not for nothing. Then why, Dutch? For living. For living? Now we get that boy back. There's other ways to live that don't involve scamming and killing and robbing everybody in your path. Hey. Milton. Good day, fine people. Yeah. I'm honestly not surprised at all. Who are you? Rip Van Winkle. Huh. Good day, sir. Agent okay, Miller, he's like, uh, alright, I haven't seen you before, but I guess that's your name. How does he not know who John is? He knows Arthur and... Ooh, ooh, got him good. Well, that's just... That's just rude to the Native American people. This thing, it's done. This place ain't no such thing as civilized. It's man so in love with greed he has forgotten himself and found only appetites. Very As enunciated. That lets you take what you please, kill whom you please, and hang the rest of us. Hmm. He's right, though. They're, he's right. Lost souls you've led so horribly astray. I'm nothing but a seeker. Mr. Milton. These two sound like they've practiced speeches. Like they have a lot of arguments with themselves in the shower. Figurative shower at this point in time. Mm. He's actually giving us a chance to go. Risk life and limb in this den of low lives and murderers so that they might live and love. Ain't that fine? <laughs> uh, uh, I don't want to kill all these uh, 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 Dutch. Just you. Ooh. In that case, ooh. It'll be my honor to join you. Excuse me, friends. I have an appointment to keep with. They're very loyal. I think your new friend should leave now, Dutch. You're making a big mistake. All of you. <laughs> well, he did give us a chance, we have got but I'm assuming, to live since I he wasn't willing to go after us before, friends. they're going to come at us even harder Stop now. And if they could we'll find us, soon. you know, both I places can't. before, I mean, not like it was really hard to find us, right? We're just in some random open field. He die. snuck up on us unnoticed, place, and fools. as he just said, Run. all of you will die. Get your damn hands. There's a very likely chance that that's true. What now? We get out of here and quick. Yeah. Okay. So we are gonna go to San Denis or Shady Bell. Swamps outside San Denis. I'm sure they'll find us. Aha! But it should buy us a few days. A few days. All we need. There's a spot out by Shady Bell. Lenny and I got into that dispute with the previous See? occupiers. See, I wasn't crazy. We killed them all, because they're a bunch of racist sure militia members. Lenny, you go follow those fools out of here. Make sure that they leave. And John, we'll get Jack back, and we'll get going. Rest of you, get packing! Come on, Let's John. go, John. Go scout out our new home. We need a new spot often. It's gonna be all right, John. You should be going for Jack. Well, we gotta regroup. We gotta find some place to lay low. 
ish. Not really laying low, more like laying medium. Laying low enough to where we're not just killed on the spot. We can hang out for a little bit. Hmm. John's starting to John's starting to realize this is why he's the protagonist in the other game. He's thinking logically. Exactly. Master con men working their magic. They thought there was a lot of gold. Yeah, they thought there was money. Ain't there always? He's starting to realize. I don't know what to tell you. Things don't always. I'm sure he's not the only one though. Arthur's going to realize at some point. We lost Sean. This this whole This whole setup that they have here is just not sustainable. True. On, it ain't all bad. We've had a rocky run, but we'll be okay. We'll get through it. Should we be having this conversation with that other guy on the horse right there? Come up with a big plan. Right now, every plan gets us into worse trouble. We're getting further from where we're meant to be going. It's very true, John. John's becoming a good father and thinking rationally. I'm coming around to this guy. I'm seeing why he's a protagonist. So we keep going to these places to like to, to settle, and it's just like a few miles away from the last camp. Like, it's no wonder the Pinkertons keep finding us. We gotta travel farther, like out of the state maybe. Not just some random abandoned house, two miles down the road, which was another two miles from our old place. Alright. Is there, is there anybody in here? Hey! Yeah, I killed all your friends. I'm not any of those. You, you know I'm pointing a shotgun at your face, right? Well, I'm stealing your house. Not me, though. Unless you put that gun down. Well, you do know all your friends are dead, so nobody's continuing your fight, pal. He really thought he did something there. He thought he was going to be a martyr for something important. Already forgot about him. Okay. Is this one of those we have to take a really long time walking very slowly kind of parts of the game? I used to hate those things. I've kind of come around, but if it's just dumping bodies... That's kind of boring. All right, this way. So, we'll dump the yeah, let's speed this up. I guess that was the last one. All right, Shady Bell. The Battle of Shady Bell. Which was a guy shooting himself. Not so much a battle. But it's ours now. We actually have a house. That This is a huge step up for us. We're not just living in, in the forest or... By a river, we actually have a a mansion big enough to support us all. So that's cool. Nice. We're moving on up in the world. Oh, poor Molly. She just wants Dutch's attention, and Dutch is like. I have a plan. Don't you worry. I have a, I'll talk to you later. I have a plan first. I haven't seen you speak to her like a single time in this entire game. Oh, we're going into San Denis. The big city. The civilization they've tried so f so hard to avoid, and we're going right into the heart of it. Yeah. Well, son got kidnapped. Mm-hmm. 
anyone who can put us in contact with him. Of course. And what about the Pinkertons? I'm fairly sure nobody followed us. We moved out fast. Yeah, we moved out fast and went like four miles down the road. I think we need we didn't move that far away. Put some ocean between us and all of this. That's what we should have done to begin with. Those two families, losing Sean. I see things differently now. Oh, you do. I truly believe the paradise lay somewhere in the west for us. But I just don't know anymore. So we're leaving the country now? Oh, that's a big change. Maybe. I'm still thinking about it. Hmm. Dutch doesn't have a plan. He's still making a plan. Maybe Dutch really has changed. This is unheard of. Look at this, modern technology. We really are going into the, uh, the heart of modern civilization. Well, modern 1890s civilization. Big factories, industrialization. Okay, there she is. A real city. The future. This is different. We've been hanging out in small towns and farmland. Now we're actually in an urban environment. The good news, we won't be able to kill literally every single person in this town. The bad news, there's a lot of people in this town. Which means a lot of people might be coming after us too. 